friends, welcome back and thanks for popping in. I'm really happy you're here. Today we're gonna to take a little peek at what's in my Stitch Fix box for July, 2023. I shared with my stylist that I was going on a little girl's trip with my best friend at the end of the month. We are going somewhere very, very hot, hot. <laughs> and so I was looking for pieces that were casual and fun easy to pack but also great for really hot weather like maybe a fun maxi dress that i could just throw a pair of sandals on and go kind of use from day to night and to dinners and things we're not looking to get too dressy for anything um i don't remember what was in my preview i said yes to a couple things i declined a couple of things i could not tell you i remembered that a lot of it looked good but it was things that I had to try on that I couldn't tell if it was going to look good on my body or not. So this is going to be an interesting box. If you don't know what Stitch Fix is, it is a clothing subscription box. You get five pieces of clothing. You fill out a profile. You pay Stitch Fix $25 and the stylist will get to work styling your box. Now, if you choose in that profile, you can choose to get earrings and shoes in your box. Once they've styled your box, like I just said earlier, they'll send you an email. You can say, yes, I like that. No, I don't. They will do a second restyle if they need be, and then off your box comes. If you buy anything in the box, they're gonna credit that $25 to your, whatever you're buying. And if you buy all five pieces, you're going to get a 25% discount, which I have to say, I've had a lot of five for five boxes lately. So I'm really excited to check that out. There is an envelope in here that is postage paid that you can send anything you don't like or don't want back. And as always, I will link everything down below so if you're like i don't really need a stitch fix box right now but i do really like that shirt or those shorts you got you can just go down to the link and purchase those now if something's sold out when you click the link come back in a couple of days because a lot of times things come back in stock i haven't even slipped the tape from my box but this is what it looks like it's pretty small which makes sense for summer clothing right all right let's see what i got my glasses on. Here's my self-addressed stamped envelope. You just drop that back to the post office and off it goes. You get an envelope with a uh, pricing sheet as well as some styling cards. I haven't read the note for my stylist lately on camera, so let's see who I have. I have Heather and it says, hi Christy. Oh, I had no idea. Happy 150th Stitch Day. I've been doing Stitch Fix for probably nine years now. I've done it for a long, long time. I'm a big Stitch Fix lover. It says, wow, June is in full swing and with it comes warm days and all sorts of festive summer events. I hope your calendar is jam packed with excitement and fun. Your upcoming trip to, I might tell y'all later when we get closer, but I'm not sharing it now. My upcoming, your upcoming trip to blank sounds fun. You mentioned that you loved cotton tops and shorts. I was looking for breathable pieces for the heat um, and maxi dresses. So I started this fix off with a cotton blend tee by Sanctuary, which is a favorite brand of mine, um, that will look great paired with the Vineyard Vines Everyday Shorts. Never tried Vineyard Vine shorts before, so that'll be great for a casual yet put together style. I also scooped up this navy dress. Navy's my favorite color to wear from Madison and Berkeley for its higher neckline. Both colors are making a serious comeback this summer anything from bright orange to lime green when you check out mention if there is a color or pattern that you'd like to try in your next fix style you soon take care heather okay and then she gives you some styling cards if you're you know sometimes i'll be like i don't know what shoes to wear with this or whatever those are nice to have and then oh let's go ahead and look at the prices the prices for stitch fix lately have been so great i've even seen like 28 and 36 dollar price points so I have a 54, ooh, one thing is $128. So there's a pricey item, 64, 54, 58. If I keep all five, remember you get that 25% discount, that would save me $89.50. All right, there's my bundle. I think that's that navy blue maxi dress. Y'all, I've been wearing so many brightly patterned tops this summer. I just them into the color. I feel like for so long we were in that neutral, beige cream black color palette in our homes and in our clothing and I'm so happy to see color that makes me really really happy are you on team color or team neutral I would love to hear it below as I'm opening this I did want to say if you like what you see please consider hitting that subscription button and giving this video a thumbs up it would really help out my channel all right so here's a little t-shirt this little sleeve is caught up here all right, 
This is the Sanctuary Tea. This is cute. It's just a basic tea, although it has a slight ruching right here, which will be interesting for the fit. It looks a little wrinkly, but it looks a little bit more elevated than a white tea. I don't know if it does on camera. We'll see how it looks when I try it on. Okay. Um, where did I put my paper here? So that is the Sanctuary Top $54. That's expensive for a white tea, but if it's a quality white tea, I would definitely pay it. Okay. The next thing we have is a maxi dress. Okay. There's this one. I don't know if I really, I have wide shoulders. It's just the way I was made. It's fine. But I don't know if I love spaghetti straps on me. I've never sort of gravitated toward them. This has got a little bow tie in the front. Hold on. I don't know if I love that feature either. It's got a little keyhole, which is cute. Mm. I'm not picking apart my body, ladies, because I always say you have to dress your body to make it look a little bit better. These also kind of get me because I have a little bit of the, you know, the chicken cutlet. We all have that once we hit a certain age, I feel like. So yes, I could put a denim jacket over the over this but where i'm going i'm probably not going to want to wear a denim jacket so i don't know about this one this is the whole uh the goya Thai front maxi dress for 50 dollars. the price is nice on that one okay then we've got this guy which is navy blue oh this is cute it's kind of like a halter neck which i used to love to wear halters i haven't had one on this season yet i don't really know if i like this two-toned navy because it, it's definitely they're both navy but this is like a ribbed material and then this isn't i wish it was all the same material am i just being gripey today i kind of feel like i am this is the dress that's 128 dollars, and i mean unless this does magical things for my body i don't know that i i love it just because of that I don't know okay that's all right all right here's this bright colored item what is this this is a dress wait oh it's a romper okay now I'm very long-waisted so although I'm excited about this I'm very cautious I'm trying to button this first button here um because a lot of times rompers either are really short in the shorts or they kind of cut me and give me like a camel toe <laughs> um, look, but how beautiful. I like this pattern a lot. I like it a lot. This is by Marine Layer. It kind of gives that Farm Rio look, which I love that brand, but I do not love the price of that brand. Hmm. I gotta say, I don't have a lot of hope for this just because of my long body, but that's stinking cute. That romper is $64. All right, and then last but not least, we have these Vineyard Vine shorts. I wear a size eight, that's what they sent me. And we'll see what we think. I love the little whale. I bought the um, Dear John shorts last month that were like a dark, dark denim. Y'all, I have lived in those shorts. I'll try and show you what they look like on in the try on in case you missed last month's video, but get these shorts in <laughs> there, so good. All right, let's do the try on, I'll be right back. Go ahead and talk about this adorable romper. I forgot to look at what fabric it is. If I remember when I'm editing, I'll put it right here. It feels sort of like a cotton linen blend. Very, very breathable. Um, it's got a little movement. The pattern on this is so cute. It's got great pockets, y'all. It is not cutting me in a wedgie up the back, which is very, very surprising. This one is a little bit longer than a lot of the rompers I've tried on. Now I'm very pale right now. That's just kind of the way I'm made and pale skin is beautiful. Um, I probably will lay off the 75 SPF sunscreen and maybe do like a 25 so I can get a little bit of sun <laughs> before I leave on the trip. It is a little bit lower cut so i left my bra showing just so you could kind of see that is one of the drawbacks of this for me is listen i'm getting to be at a place where i'm hot and flashy and i want the fewest amount of clothes on my body as i possibly can and having to put a cami on doesn't seem real appealing to me um is this adorable yes do i absolutely love it on my body 
I don't know that I do. Let me know in the comments what you think and let's go ahead and try on the next piece. All right, so both of these next pieces are gonna be a no a Rooney. Um, this t-shirt's $54, so it would have to be perfect and it is far from it. It's kind of see-through. Um, it's got this like slit that you can see my skin. These shorts are like a mid-rise short. I, I don't need anybody, you know, seeing my jelly there. <laughs> and I don't like the ruching on it. I don't know, you can kind of see through it. I just don't think it's flattering. I do like the length of the sleeve, but this t-shirt is a no. These shorts are not my favorite. They are cutting me up through my high knee just a little bit. I don't know if you can see and giving me a wedgie. Not that I'm trying to show my wedgie, but you know what I mean. Um, and so these, mm -mm, I don't like either one of these pieces. So these are going to be a no, but at least now I know that I don't love Vineyard Vines shorts on my body. Let's keep going. Okay, so here is that maxi dress that I wasn't quite sure about. I didn't know if I was gonna like the spaghetti straps. I am wearing the wrong bra. If you look behind, you can kind of see my bra. With this one, I'd probably wear a sticky bra or a strapless bra. I'd have to try both of them on and see. My instinct probably would be sticky bra, which is fine. It doesn't have pockets. We're not gonna we're not gonna ding it too bad for that. Um, the price is right. It's like what fifty four or fifty six dollars. I don't remember what I said in the opening. It's got really great movement. I don't even really mind the little tie here. It's not bad. I do still feel like I would probably want to wear a denim jacket with this, but I do really, I really like it. It's very cool. I feel like it's breathable. This one is lined, you guys, just to the knee, which is nice too. It's still very flowy and the lining doesn't feel like it's sticking to me. Cute. All right, let's try on that last one, the blue two-tone that I wasn't sure about. All right, so here is this little navy blue dress. This is the one that I wasn't loving, that it was two different fabrics, because I didn't feel like the navy blues really matched up. I think they really do when you're not like right in front of the camera holding it that close. I like that it's not a full maxi dress. It's more of a midi, so you could do a cute little sandal with it, something very casual. I do like the halter top. I think it leads to um, having a really pretty piece of jewelry here. Again, I have just tucked my bra straps underneath my arms. If you see a little puckering here, it's just my bra straps, but I probably do a strapless bra or again, maybe a sticky bra. I love the fit of this dress. Here's the back. but it's $128. I don't think I love it $128 worth. That's just my opinion. Okay, let me do some thinking. I will be back with a recap, hang on. I was slipping my clothes back on and I was wearing a pink pair of shorts with this top, but then I remember that I told you I would show you these shorts that I got on my last stitch fix that I've been living in. These are those Dear John shorts in a dark, dark navy, but they're not a denim that's really stiff. They're soft and movable. They just go with everything. So I'm gonna link these down below too in case you're interested. All right, guys, so I took a look at all five pieces and I decided that I'm not going to keep anything. I will say that's a little bit of a bummer because my last two boxes, I bought all five pieces in each box. And, you know, sometimes you have boxes like that. And then this one, it's no fault of the stylist, to be honest with you, because she gave me exactly what I asked for, which I can't ask for her to do anything more than that. She gave me clothes for a really hot climate that were breathable, that were colorful, that were easy to pack. What's that saying, close but no cigar? I just felt like each of them were just a little bit off for different reasons. That dress with the two different fabrics, the navy one, I liked the cut of it, but maybe not so much the $128 price point. For that price point, it's gotta be perfect, and I just didn't think it was. Those shorts gave me a wedgie, and who wants to go through their day like picking their shorts out of their butt? Sorry to say that, but not me. Um, I do also feel that every decade or so, I have to kind of figure out, I don't know if this happens to you too, but 
how to redress my body. My body shifts a little bit every decade. I do feel like from age 51 and last month I turned 53, I definitely have seen a difference in my body. So I'm trying to figure out how to dress it and make it look the best. So don't forget to hit that subscribe button and come along on my journey as I figure it out. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget if you get a stitch fix and you get a five for five, you keep everything, you do get 25% off and I'll see you soon for another video guys. Bye-bye.